It's recording, ain't it? I can't tell. Okay, it is. I, s I saw the timer. Anyway, hello. I am here in the world of VR, making sure I'm standing in the right spot, and I am not. Okay. So today, we're going to be doing the meat grinder over there. Let me pick it. That one. Now, I've played one game of this before, and it's a horror game, apparently. You want to brave the meat grinder, a survival horror experience with procedurally generated challenges and equipment. Can you find the meat within the maze and grind it before your 30 minutes runs out? Make sure the inhabitants of the maze don't grind you first. And shit like that. And then we load the scene. So, there's three warnings. Now let's get to reading it. The meat grinder is an intense experience, a wholesale sensory barrage. You should not play if you have epilepsy or sensitivity to strobing lights. You are prone to dizziness and or have balance issues. You are claustrophobic, terrified of the dark, have a fear of impalement, being ground into meaty chunks, burnt alive, or torn into shreds. Here's warning number two. It assumes you have a functional 1.5 by 2.0 meter tracked volume and can reach to the floor to pick things up. Please ensure nothing damageable is above your head or to your sides to avoid destroying lights or TVs in fits of blind panic. Always be mindful of where your cable is. Right now it's touching my ass. The meat grinder is a difficult time to experience. Expect to die a lot. It assumes you know how to play H3. Mag duplication is off. Don't know what that is. Item spawning is I've d is don't know what that is. Every bullet matters. I assume I know what that is. If you look like it, if it looks like it would kill you, it does. No respawning when you die. You stay dead. So when you die in VR, you die for reals. I'm playing on classic. These are the options. I should probably put on a nice because I don't know what that does. And then to get started, we just eat these hot dogs. That was a little bit more difficult than I thought it would be. Whenever I played it, I wasn't that scared, honestly. But I also didn't really know what was going on. Okay, here's my gun. What, sh what the shit bullets are those? Okay, narrator wants to touch it apparently. Oh, just went outside my area, I think. What? No, screw the shotgun. Last time I got the shotgun, I think... Okay, there we go. That works perfect. So the basic premise of this is you want to find the meat. Don't know what the meat is, or where it's at, and there's a couch right there. Of course the MI would find would be for the shotgun, which I'm not going to use because I don't like it.
flashlight really is the best for this, ain't it? Oh shit. Oh, that did a lot of damage. This feels like a trap. A chainsaw? Really? I think I'm doing something wrong, but I don't know what. Start, you piece of shit. Whatever, I'll keep it around just in case I just... Okay, can't put it anywhere. I guess I won't keep it around then. Even though it's probably like the best melee weapon. More shotgun! And who is texting me? I'm gonna kick their ass, Bobby! Shut up, narrator. Oh, teamwork. The average human body yields... ...number of calories and could feed a family of four for a week. Nice to know that cannibalism is great. I always knew it. Oh, this ain't good. Oh, this save this really ain't good. This is not good. Go home! Go away! Oh! What was I supposed to do?